healthy at 100. There was a guy named Joe. Joe wanted to be a famous movie star. Was he a famous movie star? No, he wasn't a movie star. He wanted to be a movie star. What did Joe want to be? He wanted to be a movie star. Did he want to be a TV star? No, 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 no. He didn't want to be a TV star. What kind of star did he want to be? A movie star, Joe wanted to be a movie star. So, first he decided to get thin. He needed a good body. He stopped eating dairy products. What kind of products did he stop eating? Well, dairy products, he stopped eating dairy products. Did he stop eating cheese? Yes, he stopped eating cheese. Did he stop drinking milk? Yes, he stopped drinking milk. He stopped eating and drinking dairy products. Who stopped eating and drinking dairy products? Joe, Joe stopped eating and drinking dairy products. What kind of products? Dairy products, he stopped eating and drinking dairy products. Next he decided no more consumption of sugar and fat. He said, I won't consume sugar or fat anymore. What did he stop? He stopped all consumption of sugar and fat. Did he eat sugar and fat anymore? No, he stopped all consumption of sugar and fat. Who stopped all consumption of sugar and fat? Well, of course, Joe. Joe stopped all consumption of sugar and fat. He stopped all consumption of what? All sugar and all fat, he stopped all consumption of all sugar and all fat. Why? Because he wanted to be a movie star, he wanted to have a thin body first. Movie stars are usually thin. So he stopped eating dairy products. He stopped consuming fat and sugar. Next he studied famous movie stars. He studied them very carefully. What did they look like? What did they do? And he saw a correlation between being a movie star and having big teeth. Did he find a connection between big teeth and movie stars? Oh yes, he did. He found a connection. He found most movie stars have very big teeth. Interesting. He saw a correlation between what? He saw a correlation between big teeth and being a famous movie star. They've reconnected. Who saw a correlation between big teeth and being a movie star? Joe saw it. Joe saw a correlation, a connection, between having big teeth and being a famous movie star. What did he find? What did he see? A correlation, a connection, between big teeth and being famous as a movie star. Did Joe naturally, genetically have small or big teeth? Well, unfortunately Joe had very small teeth. In fact, Joe had tiny little teeth. Genetically, did he have little tiny teeth or huge big teeth? He had small teeth. Joe's father had little small teeth. Joe's mother had little small teeth. All his brothers had little small teeth and Joe had little small teeth. It was genetic. Genetically he had big teeth or small teeth? Small teeth. Was it genetic or was it behavior that caused his small teeth? Well genetics, right? It was a genetic trait. It was connected to his biology connected to his family. It was a genetic trait, having small teeth. What was the correlation he found? Well, he found a correlation between big teeth and being a famous movie star. They've reconnected. 
He thought, oh no, to be a movie star I must have big teeth. But mine are tiny and small. He had a problem. So he went to the hospital and he talked to a doctor. He said, doctor, I need big teeth. Look at my teeth. They've re tiny. I'll never be a movie star. The doctor said, I'm sorry, I can't help you. You need to see a dentist, a special dentist. And so Joe went to see a special dentist, a dentist who made teeth bigger. And he said to the dentist, please help me. I want to be a movie star. But there's a correlation between big teeth and being a movie star. I have to have big teeth. And the dentist said, no problem. And so Joe had an operation. Why did Joe have an operation? He had an operation to get big teeth. Well, of course, obviously so he could be a movie star. And so he had the operation. It was successful. After the operation Joe had big whopping huge teeth. Did he have whopping big teeth? Oh yes, they were whopping huge. They were big gigantic whopping teeth, the biggest teeth in the world. Who had whopping big teeth? Joe, Joe had whopping teeth. What kind of teeth did he have? Whopping, whopping big huge gigantic teeth. What happened next? Well, obviously he became a famous movie star. To be a movie star you only need huge whopping teeth. Everybody knows this. So Joe had whopping big teeth and he was also thin. That's all that was necessary. Joe had whopping big teeth. He became a famous movie star. In fact, one year later he was the most famous movie star in the United States. Why was he the most famous movie star in the United States? Well, because he had whopping teeth. He had the biggest whopping teeth in all of America, in all of the world. Who had the biggest whopping teeth in the world? Joe, Joe had the biggest whopping teeth in the world so, of course, he was the biggest whopping movie star in the world.